Hello and welcome to the iCandy channel. In this episode, I'm going to be telling you the results of an experiment I did to try and get my laptop computer to edit 4K video, multicam 4K video, and many other things using this special peripheral called the EXP GDC. Now what it is, it's a device that allows you to install a graphics card, an external desktop graphics card onto your laptop computer. So without going into the details of how to do this, there's many YouTube videos on how to do this. I'm gonna just give you the results, down and dirty. First of all, I just wanted to say, my laptop has inbuilt the 660M GTX graphics card. Now that's quite an old graphics card. It's about maybe five years old, six years old, but it's really, really good. It works very, very good with 1080p, works perfectly with multicamming 1080p, but what about 4K? Well, I ran the results of the 4K edit test from my from my onboard GTX to the external 970 GTX. And the results are surprising. But remember, all the results today are gonna to be regarding Premiere Pro and using this setup to edit on Premiere Pro. And here are the results. When playing in normal resolution, in full resolution 4K, you get tons of drop frames. You have to lower it to display mode to one half in order to not to get any drop frames. But the same applies true for the onboard graphics, the GTX, the 660 GTX. So I wasn't gaining anything there. Then I tried playing at double speed and quadruple speed and times eight the speed and I was getting exactly the same results as my, as my onboard graphics. I tried doing a multicam with two 4K videos at one eighth of full resolution and I was still getting dropped frames. So really I found that the external 970 GTX when used on Premiere Pro is basically identical to the 660M GTX. So really I'm actually gonna give up this setup and, um, and not use it anymore because it just doesn't benefit me for my purposes which is video editing. Having said that, for gamers and people who do different things with their laptop, it actually is quite amazing because I ran Heaven Benchmark on it and I was able to get about 100 frames per second from full resolution. So I can imagine gamers really benefiting from this kind of device. Not only that, on the Lenovo Y580, which is the lap laptop model I use, it actually not only did it work well, but it actually worked with two graphics cards at the same time. So the Lenovo Y580 is quite a good option for anyone looking to add an external graphics card. And just a quick note, I tried an even better graphics card on this setup, the 780 GTX Ti, and it wouldn't even work on the EXP GTC on my setup. So do not try that at all. So in my experience of this EXP GTC, for Premiere Pro, I do not recommend using this kind of setup. It will not increase your video editing capabilities significantly at all. And therefore the only way to really start editing 4K is to actually buy a desktop or laptop computer with a 12 gigs graphics card, something really powerful. And that's gonna allow you to go in full resolution and, and be editing multicam 4K edits. If you benefited this from this video and maybe saved some money, why not give us a thumbs up to show gratitude so that we can continue finding ways to help you become a better filmmaker and a better editor. Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great, great, great day. Bye for now.